I made like a little fan. Mm. <laughs> I feel like I'm doing salsa or something. I'm like, da -da, da -da, da -da. Hey everybody, CK here, and I'm coming to you guys with another video. And boy, do I miss y'all. Like my heart is going pitter patter, pitter patter. I know kind of bold, right? But I tell you guys all the time that you can rock whatever lipstick you want to. And I chose to put my words in action on today. So this is a new look for you by MAC and I did a lip swatch video with me and the minis and this is in the color Stallion. It is like pitch black y'all, pitch black. Not matte, they're more of like a cream finish. But this video is totally not about the lipsticks but I mean I wanted to like talk about the elephant in the room, state the obvious, you know what I mean? And I am using a different microphone, which I said that in another video too, because it's been so long since I filmed, I put on my mic and it was like, not today. So y'all bear with me and we're gonna make it do what it do and I'm gonna order another one. Like, that's an intro for you, right? Okay, so I have these new powders by Becca and I wanted to bring them to you guys. This is not a full-fledged review because this is my first time using them. Actually, it's more like a first impression because I have it on right now. It's not the powder by itself, but I'm gonna tell you what foundation I'm rocking it with as we go through it. But look at here, or look at here, I should say. Look at these babies, I'm trying to, I knew that was gonna happen. But these are the new Becca powders, you guys. Before I tell you what the powder claims to do and before I show you swatches, I wanna tell you guys why I'm bringing this video to you and this is only my first time trying it. Number one, I like doing first impressions. I just do. I don't know why I like it, I just do. <laughs> and number two, I know the struggle of trying to find the perfect color foundation. Whether it be powder or whether it be liquid, we know that when we go online, the color looks nothing like it does in person or on people like in these videos. So I am bringing them to you since I have them all because you guys know I love giving you full collection swatches. So since I have them all, I was like, aha, Uptown Pokemon, I'm gonna give it to you. So there are seven colors in this collection and they are called Multitasking Perfecting Powder. And what I'm going to do is I'm gonna read off this little handy dandy paper and tell you what it claims to do. We're gonna get on with the swatches. I may give you a little demo on how I used it because I used it as a setting powder and I used it as a contour. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna let you know the ones that I use and then I'm gonna be out your way, okay? So, it's a multitasking perfecting powder and it says, go beyond powder foundation with our do it all compact. Made to keep up with your busy lifestyle, the new multitasking perfecting powder can be used for, it's like five different things y'all. Medium to full coverage foundation. Did y'all hear that? Medium to full. Finishing powder, setting concealer to highlight and contour and on the go touch-ups. It says our mineral based formula is made from extra fine jet mill pigments to create a silky texture with a natural finish. Very silky, very natural. It says it's suitable for all skin types, even the most sensitive. It contains skin loving ingredients, including aloe, red algae, vitamins A, B, C, and E. It's available in seven shades and it is available at beccacosmetics.com and Ulta online and in store. So this color is fair. This is the first color right here. And I hope that you guys can see that. That should be fine. I mean, gosh, they are so silky and smooth. But there's fair. I mean, I was trying to figure out which one I should use. Y'all know I have to swatch like two or three times. It's just, I don't know, OCD maybe? But anyway, um, they are really, really smooth. And I was trying to figure out which one I should use to set my under eye concealer. But I don't think that there's one with a real like super like, you know, it's, it's really not one like a banana powder type color. So I didn't do that. I just used it to contour and then set my whole face. This color right here is beige. Beige may be good for me setting my under eye highlight. I don't know, but that's beige. This one right here is light, but this is tan and many me one uses this like for her whole face. Okay. If she were to use it, this is the color that she will go for. And that is tan. Now I wouldn't use this to set my under eye concealer because I think it's a little dark and I like to have that highlighted effect or highlighted look, but there is tan right there. I do think that when you swatch it, I think it swatches a tad bit darker than it is in the pan. Unless I'm just tripping. And this is the color I used to set my whole face. As you can see, it totally looks like my skin tone, right? Wait, there we go. Mm-hmm. Warm honey. 
I'll take honey. I'll be honey. I'm cool with that. As you can see, it really wears it. Wait, wait. You can't really see it because it blends in with my skin so well, but it's down there. Oh my gosh, you really can hardly see that. Now for my contour, I used dark golden, but you guys are about to get happy glad, especially my chocolate chocolate sisters out there. Y'all will totally appreciate this. I promise. Watch. So this is dark golden and this is what I use to contour with. But of course you can use these as a powder as well. So if you are the skin tone, you can totally use that. But I use it to contour. And y'all know that I have these super high cheekbones, so I really don't have to contour at all, but I like to. So when I do, I like to do it with a very, very light hand. So I chose this one right there. And you can kind of see my little contour line. And again, this is dark golden and let's swatch that baby. So there is dark golden right here, dark golden. So before we go to this one, y'all like how I keep it on suspense, but I'm going to tell you that I rock this foundation. This is the Clinique Super Balanced Makeup. I have a video all about it, like a wear test, all that good stuff on this foundation. So I have that on and then I put the powder on top and then I did my contour and all that stuff. Okay. And so far I'm loving the way they mesh together. Like it is, it is working out for my life. I'm pleased with it. Now, are y'all ready? Are you ready? And bam, what? I told y'all, that's deep bronze. And I totally could contour with this. But as I said, I already have like, like chiseled cheeks, if you will. So I don't wanna look like that. There you go. These are all the colors. Kind of looks like eyeshadows on my hands, huh? But these are all the colors and I think we are hashtag winning with these. So they look awesome, they feel awesome and so far, they work pretty good. But you know what would be even better is if they came out with like a whole line of them to where there's like all kinds of undertones, that would be bomb. But you guys, make sure that if you're not subscribed to my channel that you subscribe because we have fun over here and I give you updates and you will see me using products more and more and get ready with me's or in just straight up tutorials, okay? And also if you follow me on Snapchat, when I'm not on here, I give you updates on there. I try different things on there. I do unboxings on there. It just, it goes down everywhere, okay? So if you're not a part of the family on either aspect of my social media, join, 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 okay? So that is it for this video, you guys. I hope that I made your decision making that much easier, okay? So if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to thumbs up. And y'all have an awesome, blessed day. And I will see you sooner than you think. Bye. Sicky beauty, confidence is key. You know what I mean. A woman feels good when she's looking pretty. I don't need no Benz, Lexus, or a Range Rover. Just give your girl a bomb, Sicky beauty makeover. Confidence is key, ladies. You know what I mean. Or maybe her eyeshadow and mascara will help you see. Check out her foundation and the blush on her cheek. Yeah, we ain't playing games. It's the Sicky beauty. Yeah, Sicky beauty.